Max. Maximilian. Vicar. Vicky. What? Shoot, I forgot. It'll come to me. Something on your mind? By verity, by strength. What are we contemplating today? Yes, I've been meaning to discuss exactly that. It... Can't believe I got my own bunk. Good to see you, boss. I don't think I like this place one little bit. The intrepid crew of the unreliable brave the wilds of Monarch onto...
that clever. Nicely done. I guess this is what Edgewater is gonna look like in a couple of years. Eyes up, boss. We're rambling into the jaws of danger. Let's take him down! Hey, I remember Cascadia from that one episode of Terror on Monarch. Crawling with monsters, it was. I would have liked to seen this place. Before it was all boarded up. I bet it lit up the night.
You sure we ought to go this way, Captain?
us out. Looks like we're doing this. here and a mad queen showed up then wrapped it on it was a void blasted mess i ran in here and um now the door's locked little help it's easier than it sounds all right phew thanks mister my buddy had a key but i ain't heard him in a while so I'll look for a dead guy i guess all yours, mister. Ah, phew. Thank you so much. It was getting all stuffy in there, and I was getting a mite lightheaded, and I think maybe I was gonna die. Now I'm out here, and I'm headed back to Amber Heights. Oh, sure, I'm a runner. I'm used to getting all dizzy, and hey, who is your identical, slightly blurry friend? Thanks a lot, mister. Thank you. 
Here they come! Feels like the old bits outside of Edgewood. Smells like those old Sundays when we'd unload salt tuna shipments at the cannery. We gotta go exploring. If Velma's capable of... Hello, dearie. Why, I don't believe I've seen you before. And with sweet cheeks like those, I'd remember. What can Auntie Abigail do for you? She works over at the fishery next door. Why, just the other day, I heard her shouting from here. Oh, but here I go again, running my mouth when it's none of my business. Yes, indeed. Oh, but I am. <laughs> Velma seem out of sorts to you? She's always cranky. No, I mean... More than you. Look, you can tell Catherine the new shipment will be ready when it's ready, all right? 
She's welcome to come up here and pack boxes herself if she's in such a hurry. Sorry, seems I got my cables crossed. Thought you were another shakedown tough from Fallbrook. Hope you can forgive my temper. This job has been running me ragged lately. First, my autoloader foreman stages a walkout, and now my chief pescatological health manager is missing. Braxton. He's in charge of getting the fish fat, but also making sure they don't get too many tumors. He's a real wizard with pharmaceuticals, but he has creative notions of working hours. Comes with living in a free colony, I guess. I can't keep working double shifts either. Since you don't seem to be constrained yourself, maybe you could check up on him. Tell him Velma said to get his lazy ass down here, or she might start noticing those extra drugs he's been taking from supply. Something else on your mind? Sublight boss out of Fallbrook. Handles most goods that come in or out of Stellar Bay. Caleb Herrick. Runs the autoloader operators. He thinks I don't pay them enough for flipping switches and turning dials. So the job's easy, but you're not doing it? Something smells here. I mean, everything smells in here, but something's fishy. Uh, wait. He and his whole crew walked out. Say they won't come back unless I pay them more. Because we've got a budget, all right? And in case you haven't noticed, MSI doesn't exactly have a lot of spare bits on hand. Mr. Nandi? Just make sure it's properly dog. I'll move it next to the others, sir. And the little bastard's slippery, right? On account of its blood, so it's it's sliding all over the place, trying to crawl away. Getting so I can't tell the Tell the blood from the mud. But I gotta get in there. Get right in that baby rap stomach and dig it out. If so much as a drop of stomach acid got on that medallion, I... Shit, I don't know what I'd do. Might be I'd hunt every damn wrapped out there. Right. What are you staring... Wait. You ain't from around here. Who are you? Ooh, charmer. Don't get a lot of that around here. Folks mostly grump at me about how I should join the MSI payroll. Nice change of pace. Buy me a drink, will you? Outstanding! What are you doing in Stellar Bay, stranger? Well... Well, well, well. Let's get down to brass nuts then, shall we? Brass, wait, that ain't it. Brass rats? Let's, let's talk business. I'm headed back out there after I sober up. You want a guide sooner than that? You'll have to get me something to clear my head. Outstanding. I'm cut off for the month, on account of needing one just about every damn day. But I'm sure you've got your wily ways. Well, they work. Hello again, dearie. And what a helpful young man you are. 
Nothing like a little pill to liven up the spirits. Who's your lucky friend, dearie? I'm so sorry, but with the iconoclasts and the marauder filth chasing away what little trade we get, I'm afraid I have to reserve my supply for Stellar Bay residents. Our reserves have gotten so low, I've even had to start locking the supply room upstairs. Isn't it just... I'd make an exception for you if I could, my little cherub. <laughs> Aren't you a saucy thing? Now, I may not be a fresh young thing anymore, but with age comes experience, dearie. Much as I'd love to, my rheumatism is especially fierce at the moment, and I but I'd hate to send you away empty-handed. Now, now, there's also I... Now, now, dearie, it is my job, after all. The Charmer! Welcome back! All of the above? More or less dangerous than a steady supply of alcohol. Give it in. Whew, that hits the spot. Right in the, uh... Oh, no, there it is. There it is. Yes. We're in business. Let's go. Great. Where to? Oh, Hiram? I ain't checked in on that man in an age. He's running the giant radio tower we lovingly call Devil's Peak. We'll be going south and west, mostly along the road till we're past Fallbrook. Out there, there's a western slope that'll lead us through some, uh, some fun. You like hunting, right? That's fun. If you're more of a spelunker, Rotting River will take you into the mountain caverns. We can discuss options when we get closer. That said, uh, three... A real big game hunter. You gotta give me some pointers. Oh, no, no. Monarch ain't safe, even with me around. I've just got intimate knowledge of its dangers and an abundance of fortitude. Folks hire me because I know what you can shoot and what you ought to run from. Well, well. If you're keeping Nioka company, you'll need a few to keep up with her. Ain't a person on this planet who can keep up with me. Wait, we are talking about a drinking contest, right? Now what can I do for you? Not since Amber Heights. These days we have more leaving than coming. Off to join the Iconoclasts or some such. Bunch of marauders broke into the executive compound, slaughtered everyone. Corporations pulled out of Monarch not long after. I thought everyone knew, but then that was ten years ago. But it had a fancy ring to it. Name's the first advertising anyone sees, after all.
Ah, uh, don't be so negative. It's what's on the inside that counts. Speaking of, you look like you could use a bottle with something good in it. 